Hey guys, Joshua Peterson here, Peterson Electric. Want to do a video today on an attic, um, 1937 home, knob and two. If you've ever been familiar with that term, it means porcelain knobs and two wire drilled through the studs. Um, typically, that stuff can last a long time as long as it's not tampered with. And um, you're not supposed to put insulation on top of the connections where they actually wrapped it. Um, here's a house that, um, in Colorado that is horrible absolutely horrible to come out on the service call and just hear that lights are flickering let me show you what i found here and by the way this is what not to do and um, this is really bad news this is just me walking up in an attic to see it so here's some of our connections UF cable right here. Sorry, I'm trying not to fall through. Tells me this was rewired somewhere in the 80s. Cause look at the color of those con the NM cable and BX. Just wires hanging out. Oh yeah, there's some knob and two connections, real choice. And I'll show you my favorite. Energizing the metal ducting. Just piercing the insulation. And I hope this video will help to see that this house was just sold a few years ago. And all this shit's been here for a long time and yet our home inspectors huh, shouldn't even be called an inspector home lookers in Colorado are not licensed and nor did they see any of the stuff that these people have to do now they have to suck out all this insulation and rewire their home because there's nothing we can do to try to help this and energize the circuit that's already been flickering this is just a safety hazard for us so it's all over the place Anyways, that's why sometimes we get on these jobs and it ain't even worth a service call. Just better to walk away. Um, I try not to swear on YouTube, but man, that's some dumb stuff that people do to people's homes. And then they sell them and get a profit. And then the next person inherits all these problems. And then yet they get a bitch at me for not having a permit on a can light. Yeah, right. Have a good one.